Question 15. Mary needs to work out the size of angle X in the diagram. She writes, X is 63 because angles in an isosceles triangle are equal. Mary is wrong. She's wrong because the base angles in an isosceles triangle are equal. So if these two lengths are equal, the same as these two, then it would be 63 and 63 where x would be the top angle. So she is wrong because only the base angles in an isosceles triangle are equal. So that is the reason you would give for part A. William needs to work out the size of angle y in the diagram. William writes angle EGF, EGH, so EGH, so this angle here, is 57 because corresponding angles are equal and y equals 180 minus 57 because angles in a straight line add up to 180. One of William's reasons is wrong. Write down the correct reason. The correct reason is that EGH is 57, however it is because they are alternate angles, not corresponding angles. So the reason you would give is they are alternate angles. And that is the end of question 15.